Gemini, come on in, put your feet up, make yourselves at home. My name's Jen Dawson, welcome to Gem TV. All right, Gemini, what do you need to know about love? Bear in mind, my loves, these are general readings, so it's not going to resonate with all of you, but if it does, take a look in the description box below. There's a link to my Patreon if you want to watch extended videos. You can also purchase individual videos via my website, gentvtarot.com, or you can join my channel. See which one you fancy. I am doing private readings again. You can purchase them only via my website. gentvtarot.com. It's the only way you can get them. If, I, if I'm in your DMs trying to give you a reading, that's not me. All right. Gemini, what do you need to know about love? It's not great, Gemini. I'm gonna be honest, it's not great. This is the bottom of the deck. It's time to walk away from. I sort of feel like this is a person that you've been waiting for, you've been wanting this person. Um you'd do anything to be with them. This is your one. Trouble is, it's not my love. It's not, it's, this is not your person. I don't think this is going to be a long reading for you. Because I don't see any cards that are leaning towards, hey, there's a little bit of hope because there's no, I don't see any hope with this person. Excuse me. This is what you need to know right now. There's a little bit of confusion right now. Knight of Swords in reverse. A little bit of confusion. Ooh. Two of Cups. Came out sideways though. I sort of feel like, you know what I'm getting with this is and also with this, this person, it's like they behave badly. They don't really care who they hurt, what happens. I don't think this person was taught much about, as they were growing up, perhaps was taught much about consequences. If you do something bad, it's going to hurt. People are gonna get hurt. You're gonna get hurt. Tell me more. This person behaves badly and doesn't care whether they get away with it. I, I sort of feel like if you ever get any kind of apology from this person, it's a bit half assed. Just a little bit, like, you're yeah, sorry. Sorry I ripped your heart out and showed it to you. Sorry about that. I didn't mean it. All I'm getting from this is that you're just going to be lonely and sad. Ten of Cups in reverse is not your person. This whatever was is over. Temperance in reverse for what's coming up in the near future. Again, not great. This is like, I, I sort of, as this is a, a card of in the future, I sort of want to say temperance in reverse is sort of saying, it, yeah, there sort of isn't any long term future stuff going on here for you guys. I, it's almost like seeing them in the future, hmm, looking through the fog of time, not seeing an awful lot. You 
Yeah. And it's not easy for you. I sort of feel like they're out there having a really great time without you and that's a little bit painful for you. I would keep my eyes off their social media and what's going on in their life if I were you. It's, it's no good for you. The best you can hope for, two of swords. That's, that's not great. It's, it's a card of, I don't know. I sort of want to say, should I, shouldn't I? You shouldn't. Am I getting anything else here? You want to make that decision of like, do I wait for them to make their mind up? I'd say no. For you, we've got the chariot in reverse. Now this is, this is a card of chasing after somebody and, and, and pursuing them. I think that you're going to finally get it and stop. But there's always this feeling that you're sort of holding on to them a little bit. You're, I, I, maybe you're one that got away. Let's have a look at that. Yeah, they're sort of special, you know. Um, I'm, I'm feeling the emotions here of of uh, how you met. They're they're exciting. They're different. You're not used to someone like this, and uh, I think that because of how different they are, they're in a pretty special place in your heart. I have to say, as a, a middle-aged woman myself, I've had ones that got away. It doesn't stay like that, trust me. There comes a point in your life where you're like, well, let's see what that one that got away is doing with their time. Wow, glad they got away. I don't have one that got away anymore. It's... Uh, I have to say, leave the past. Just, just leave it there. It's, it's in the past for a reason. Just, just leave it right there in the past. You're gonna get there at some point. This person, I want to show you the outcome here. This is what they are. This is a pretty volatile, emotionally moody, uh, manipulative codependent let's just just put all of the toxic words that you can yeah that's that's what they are to clarify the outcome i think for a while there because of their behavior and and I think your ego got a little bit bruised there. I hear you. I understand that. And it might have made you a little bit obsessive about this connection. At some point, you're going to be like, nah, I'm done. I'm out. Chop. It's a pretty short reading. Let's pull you some of these. I'm going to take this extended for you. I'll ask about them. Um, let's ask about... Uh, who they are, what sign are they, what, uh, how do they really feel about you, what are their intentions towards you, what do they want to say to you, some guidance from the universe, but I think you're good, I think you're done, show the world the real you, don't hold back baby, this person's not for you, 
I think you're gonna figure that out sooner or later and uh, if they're the one that got away, it won't be for long. Put your love lyric for the day. At night I wake up with the sheets on the wet and a free dream running in the middle of my head. Only you can cool my desire. Oh, 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 I'm on fire. If you don't know that song, shame on you. So I'm on fire by Bruce Springsteen. Check it out. Thank you for joining me. See you later.